Good morning, everyone. Paul from HBC Handyman here. Um, <clears throat> I thought I'd give you a bit of an overview of my boat today. Uh, the one I've been talking about and uh, the, the workshop modifications I've been making are all for this baby. Um, she's a 32 foot catamaran. Um, the, uh, I must say I was a little bit disappointed when I received the plans. There wasn't a lot of information. Um, the uh, the frames here, which are the, the, the basis of the hulls and, and give you the shape of the hulls, for example, uh, only come in this CNC format. I don't want to get it CNC cut out. I want to do the whole job myself. I like to do things from the ground up. Uh, that way I know it's strong. That way I know it's, it's built well. Um, I've got options here of making these frames out of foam or plywood. So, um, And CNC cutting these days is quite expensive. I think I've got a quote um, about $150 a panel. And there's seven or eight panels there. So, look, it's going to take me a day or two to cut them out. I'd rather do it that way and, and, and save the dosh. Um, anyway, I have converted these frames here into a layout. So, using AutoCAD, I have just basically mapped these frames out. I put a 100mm grid in here, as you can see, and there's all my dimensions. So, they're ready to go for me to mark that up onto plywood, basically. Um, so there's all the frames, uh, you know, you can see there's one more, more towards the front of the boat or the bow of the boat. Um, there's one towards the rear, the S14 panel. Uh, that one I've actually got timber here to make. Um, I'll probably do that in a composite, two, four mils with a frame in the middle and some glass. It will come up immensely strong and immensely light. Uh, looking forward to it. Here's the boat. Um, a lovely little boat. Reminds me of a NACRA. The hull shape reminds me of NACRA. I used to race NACRA boats, um, the 5.8 specifically, and a beautiful racing machine. These hulls remind me of that beautiful, long, sleek hulls. Um, a, a very, very little displacement. Um, they just look fast, and, and it got me in. I think one of the things that, you know, if you are going to build a boat, you need to fall in love with it before you do. It's a big, hard task. And if you don't enjoy and, and, and um, you know, have some sort of drive towards an end goal, uh, you're not going to get it finished. So as you can probably hear in my voice, I've already fallen in love with this boat. I think it is a beautiful looking machine and I'm ready to go, I tell you. Um, and, you know, you don't have to spend big bucks on a boat like this. Um, I, you know, I, I, look, you know, you, if you do all, most of the work yourself, you can build it at a quarter of the price or a third of the price of what someone else will build it for you for. So uh, I'm really looking forward to getting into this this boat, and, and I hope that gives you a bit of an overview of um, uh, uh, the, the, the boat that I'm building. Um, and, and, you know, the, the work involved the initial, in the initial stages of the planning. Um, you know, not only have I had to re um, lay out all these hulls, but obviously, you know, you've got to get your material list right, you've got to get everything right ready to go um, so that you um, everything goes smoothly basically um, and, and to, to make matters worse uh, not matters worse but to make it more difficult for me I live on an island so everything comes over on my ute which you've seen in my other videos um, and one of the things that I always worry about when I build a boat this is my fourth boat mind you I've done bigger boats than this too um, is getting it to the water what am I going to do well this is a boat that only comes in at about 1500 kilos complete at 32 feet i'm hoping i can get on a big car trailer and just take it down to the water so that's my hope <laughs> and um, uh, we'll see what happens in two years time when she's ready to go to the water that's my plan by the way to get it done in two years hey thanks for listening uh there'll be plenty more videos to come bye